Hi guys, it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel. This video has been very highly requested. Today I'm filming my summer morning routine. It's currently 9.30 right now. I actually woke up at 7 though because today's a Tuesday and I posted a video. If you guys have been keeping up with the recent summer videos, you guys probably noticed I've been back to my old posting schedule, which is two videos a week every Tuesday and Friday at 7 a.m. PST. I'm gonna try my best to keep that going. It's definitely a lot, but I've been having so much fun with summer content. So make sure to keep up with my community tab on my channel because I always update if I'm posting two videos a week and which videos they are. But anyways, I feel like every morning I've been waking up at a pretty decent time. Yes, there are definitely some days where I sleep in until like 12 or 1 p.m. But for the most part, I've been going to bed at like 11 or midnight. So I've been waking up like not too late. So that's good. But today is actually 4th of July. Happy 4th. You guys aren't watching this on the 4th, obviously, but I hope your guys' 4th of July was good. I will be going to the beach today. But first, we're gonna have a productive morning together. It is time to get this day started. summer skincare routine with some sunscreen. I use the Glossier Invisible Shield. This one has SPF 35 and I think it's pretty good. I literally just squirt it all over my face. <laughs> also, I got water on my shirt when I was brushing my teeth. Does that happen to anyone else? Besides that, I'm having a great day so far. I've only been up for a little bit, but the vibes are really good today. I'm also just like so excited to go out as well. Yesterday, I had a very chill, relaxing day at home and it was great, but most of the day I was sleeping. So I just like didn't feel productive. I wasn't really doing anything, but like today we're starting our day off strong and I don't know I just feel great I think it's really important during the summer especially to take breaks and have those relaxing kind of days But it's also really good to have a routine set goals for yourself and just to start the day off with getting yourself ready Listening to fun music that always puts me in a really good mood Anyways now I wanted to show you guys my updated makeup routine A lot of you guys have been asking what makeup products I use what's my routine So I thought this would be the perfect video to do it in I feel like I've shown a lot of these products already in my past few videos but i'll explain in depth and everything i do not wear this makeup every single day a lot of the days i just like the natural look and just like curl my lashes and call it a day but if i'm feeling fun i'll do this makeup routine first i'm going to use these clips to clip my hair back these are from princess polly and i just want to put my bangs out of the way so i don't get makeup in them oh and by the way i'm not going to really do anything to my hair today since i'm going to the beach like i don't think it matters anyway and the less heat that i put on it the better so next going in with the rare beauty always an optimist spray i love how refreshing this feels like always do this before I start my makeup. <laughs> I just sprayed like 10 times. It feels so good. I've said this before, but Rare Beauty is definitely one of my favorite makeup brands. Next, going in with the Glossier Skin Tint in G7. Glossier is also another one of my favorites. Just any brand really with like the simple minimalistic look, I feel like is my favorite because I'm very natural, not too many products, just some to enhance the face. But I just spread this on my face with my fingers. No brush needed, just need your fingers. But I feel like this is a good product to just even out my skin tone. The top half of my face usually tans more than the bottom half so I feel like putting the skin tint on just makes the color more even. Next I'm using the Glossier Boy Brow. I've literally had this for so long that the logo like rubbed off. Definitely I'm gonna get a new one of these very soon but this one's in clear. I don't really like adding too much to my brows because I feel like they already have some color so I don't want to make them too dark. Now for my all-time faves the Rare Beauty Blush and Highlighter. This is probably my favorite part of my makeup routine. I love the dots. They're so fun but this blush is in the shade Happy and I love the color. Blends out great. Super cute. Same with the highlighter. This one's in Enlighten and I do them at the same time because I just like mix them when I blend and again it's so fun. Like I look forward to doing this stuff. Then I take this Real Techniques brush. It's the number 204 and I mix the colors, kind of like swoop it in a circle motion and then I'll slowly like tap it into my face. But I think I've said this before on my channel, I love blush. I think it's so fun, adds such cute color to the face and I think it looks good on everyone. I also put some on my nose. I just like tap it with the brush. I know it looks very pigmented right now, but trust me, it calms down. Now I'm going in with the Fenty Beauty Matchstick in the shade Mocha. I just take it with this random contour brush and I tap it into my face like that. I don't want anything too harsh, so that's why I don't like draw it on my face. I just take it with a brush, but I feel 
like um, adding this right under the blush it blends everything seamlessly and it looks so good. Now I'm using my Kaja Moon Crystal in Luminary. This is also another fun part in my makeup routine. It's kind of like liquid eyeshadow almost, but I just squeeze them on my finger and then tap it onto my eye. I don't do anything crazy with eyeshadow. I literally just do this, like tap it and blend it out. And I feel like it's so cute, like just the shimmer and sparkle. It's also just like so simple, you know? And then I do the same thing on the other eye. Oh, also, yes, this is... Oh my gosh, my stomach is growling. <laughs> but there are the eyes. Then I'm gonna go in with my spray one more time just to set all of the cream products that I use. And to add even more sparkle because the eyeshadow wasn't enough, I'm going in with the Anastasia, what is this called? Amrezy highlighter. I remember when this was so popular and I had to hop on the bandwagon because it's so good, honestly. I just take it with this Fenty eyeshadow brush and tap it onto the eyeshadow. Just kind of like set it in place and to make sure that the glitter like lasts a while. I also use the same brush and go in into my inner corner. This step is so good to like waking up your face and just making you look more alive. And then lastly, I'll go in onto my nose, a little on the top and a little on the bottom and that's it almost done next is mascara of course i'm using my shiseido eyelash curler this is my holy girl product i know i've said it enough but i will keep saying it this will forever be my favorite eyelash curler of all time it's just so good and now my favorite mascara the maybelline sky high this mascara is perfect for lengthening your lashes i've been using this mascara for a long time as well and it's just stuck like it's so good and i haven't found another one that i like better i'll just do a few coats though this tube is running out i'm gonna have to get a new one soon but i don't want to do it too much where it looks clumpy and i'm done sometimes i'll go in with a lip gloss but i just didn't today so here is the finished makeup look i'll try to put affiliate links to all the products that i showed you can check down below in the description box <laughs> made my room is surprisingly clean at the moment i feel like you never know with my room most days i have clothes to put away but i do not also i feel like this is known but when it comes to cleaning your room making your bed is the easiest and best thing you could do first because once you have your bed made it like pulls together the whole room and it looks cleaner already so a little reminder if you're not making your bed in the morning make sure to make your bed <laughs> Time to get ready for the beach. Here's the sitch. Fourth of July is basically like the last day of school. It's tradition to go to the beach during the day. So the beach is going to be packed. I remember last year, you could barely see the sand. Like that's how many people there were just standing. But anyways, I have my little outfit on. Blue and white hat from Princess Polly. Blue top from Princess Polly. I'm wearing bikini bottoms from Black Bow, but these shorts are from a souvenir shop in Hawaii. But now you guys are going to help me pack my beach bag. This is the bag that I bring to the beach. I've brought like tote bags to the beach as well. But personally, I like clothes like backpacks better because no sand and we'll get into them. Tote bags, I always come back with like a bucket of sand in my bag. But I actually already have stuff in here from past beach days. I have some sunburn products. I cannot forget sunscreen. Your girl does not do good in the sun. I went to the beach like last week with my friends. I was probably there for like two hours. Came home looking like a freaking lobster. I'll show a picture. My back was terrible, like literally so red and it hurt for like the next few days too. So hopefully someone reminds me to reapply sunscreen throughout the day. If not, I'll be the same color as my shorts. But I'm gonna go downstairs, get a towel and some water. I'm like, what else do I need? All right, we keep our towels in this cabinet downstairs. These are pool towels and then these are more beach towels. Let's see. Hmm. Let me call it you this one. Oh. The Disney one. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Like a sarong. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna bring this Disney one. They sent it in a PR package. I think it's a collab with SandCloud. <coughs> it's so cute. It has a bunch of Minnie and Mickey Mouse's on it. Next, I'm gonna fill this water bottle. I love this pink Hydro Flask. I honestly die without water. Like, having water at the beach is an essential. <laughs> If not, you'll just be doomed. I don't know. Okay. Done. Guys, look at my mom and Sadie. Hi, mom. Hi, sweetie. <laughs> Enjoying the backyard. Oh my gosh, today's such a nice day. I know. Are you hungry? Yeah, I might go to Starbucks and pick something up. I am so excited for the beach <laughs> now. It's so nice. I'm just finishing packing my bag and I might leave soon. Got my towel. 
water bottle. I'm also packing a brush because I my hair always gets tangled at the beach. Claw clip in case I take off my hat and just want to put my hair up. Mm. Okay, and then in the front pocket, bringing my keys. Oh my god, stop! I have a brush in here already. Okay, well that's cool. I'm gonna bring this mini one instead of the big one. I also put wet wipes in here. Always an essential. Those can never go wrong. And then finally, out the floor. Okay, I think I'm done. Oh, by the way, if you recognize this bag, I got this in Florida for like a dance nationals and I have a little Minnie Mouse on it. Last thing, if you're wondering why I put makeup on and I'm going to the beach, there's like a 99.9% .9 chance that I'm not going in the water. Like <laughs> today I plan on just talking to friends, chilling on the sand. Like I don't do good in sun and I don't do good in the ocean. So that's why I have makeup on because I'm not really worried about like messing it up if I go in the water. And it's 4th of July, so just for fun. Got the goods. Guys, I haven't gotten this drink in so long. If you watch the last few school vlogs of junior year, oh my gosh, you know that I got like a million of these, basically a million, because it was so good, but I got one today. This is a grande strawberry acai lemonade with no strawberries included. Literally so good. And then for breakfast, I just got <clears throat> a warmed up bacon gouda sandwich. These are also really good. I would always get them. I'm like middle school, so like it's kind of nostalgic. But anyways, I am now off to the beach. That is basically what a summer morning looks like for me. Obviously, it's different every single day depending on what I'm doing. But like I said, the vibes are great. <laughs> it's a beautiful day today. And I hope you guys, whenever you're watching this, are having a good time. And I hope your summer is going really good. Oh my gosh, it's sad. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my gosh, um, I went to Starbucks and he went to Best Buy and they're like in the same plaza and I guess he's heading home now But <laughs> I just saw him in his car. But I just want to say again. Thank you for all your support When I'm filming this we're currently at 2.99 million subs so, Almost at 3 mil. It's just crazy to me, but I just love you guys so 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 much and I just need y'all to know Happy 4th of July <laughs> If you guys stay till the end of this video comment down below the beach emoji with like the umbrella thingy I'll put it on the screen Oh Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications, and go cop some cooling merch. I'll see you guys back with another video. I love you guys so, so much. Stay positive. Bye. Mwah.